I finally got the Platinum Trophy for the worst game that has ever been made. Nope, I'm not talking about Cyberpunk 2077. At least Cyberpunk was able to sell more than 2,000 copies on the PS5. Nope, I'm talking about New Tales from the Borderlands, the latest addition to the Borderlands universe. If I had to summarize this Platinum in one word, it would be catastrophe. But, all jokes aside, this Platinum Trophy was 40 hours of pure torture. So let's get this shitstorm started. The game opens up in a science lab where one version of ourselves proves her woke scientific knowledge by solving her first problem with violence. Dude, I'm, I'm, I'm digging a scientist with all those sexy earrings and whatnot in their head. <laughs> Slapping successful. Oh, I'm a slap master. First trophy, who needs keys, baby? It's like it's singing. Contrary to all but a few of the Telltale games, this Telltale imposter has a swath of different trophies for completing miscellaneous tasks, but they are ultimately still unmissable as the story forces you to get the bulk of them. Take these two trophies, for example. You be careful out there, all right? You too. Oh man, Please. she's not gonna be oh, in it no man. more. Take this for me. I don't want these TDR bastards getting their hands on my lucky Vaultlander. It'll be safer with you. What? Is this you? Each sold separately. Yeah. I won yeah. in a stupid contest or whatever. No big deal. It's just like the only one in existence. Okay. Yep. There it is. Close pop-ups. Okay. How do I do this? Too easy. Enter pin. Zero three two. Okay. What? What? You gotta do it before it scrolls through. That's I, that that's a shitty game mechanic. Sorry. I'm not gonna give you props for something like that Like I had the zero in there and it just auto scrolled to the next one Like come on now Squash bugs Can't even move it. I just gotta hit X. I feel like this I, I could do this one. I could play this whole game one-handed We're in Jackpot this is one sweet executable. You might think that because I will continuously dunk on this game like my name is Lay Boss James that I hated everything about it, but that's only partially true. In fact, some of the humor in this game actually got me to laugh during my first playthrough because, I mean, who doesn't like tacos? That's lame. We should be safe here. No, no, we're not. They're like right there. Uh, Roger that, sir. I wish I ate more tacos. Mas por favor. Wait, that worked? You Much know? like the developers of this <laughs> yeah, like, game, really my can. next two trophies were for failing and watching my hard work spiral down the porcelain yes. throne. Yes. <laughs> I... <Come on. laughs> Losers. Susan Coldwell, decimator of glass ceilings and souls. Ma'am. Okay. We were pursuing a rebel, she but kills people. Housed by this woman, and we wanted to shoot her, but she's a TDR licensee, and now our guns will fire. And ah, uh, damn licensee loophole. I will have the gunsmith fix that before the next station. Oh shit! They blew me up. <laughs> There was a glitch. I don't know. Something happened. Tail in the toilet. You'd be wrong. So basically, my computer shit out on me. 
and it dropped me into this right here. I don't know what's happening. It's also not got my webcam up for some reason. See, look, there it is. The, yeah, yeah, my webcam died on me. Like, everything just shit out all of a sudden. And it blew me up. You've seen that part. And now we're at a tail over. Which I think we got a trophy for it anyway, so I think it'll be fine. Despite fighting through technical difficulties with my gaming PC, my next seven trophies were unmissable and are earned for playing through the story sober. Mostly sober. Oh, she's gonna walk up and watch the diner explode. Octavio. Think her brother died. Boom! Wow, I should write video games. That was so cliche right there. From zeros the final portion of episode one let's fight let's go baby i don't even know how this works but it's gonna be awesome is it like beyblade that's it do you get like two attacks per what is going on what the hell? What is this? Is this is like some form of like Dungeons and Dragons Beyblade here. Not a fan of this, but okay. To finish him. Ooh! Come get some with my six arms of justice. Don't get cocky. Y'all missed a hell of a fight. Let me tell you what. That was a hell of a fight y'all missed out on. Shard Snatchers, episode two in the books. Got a These lucky three contestants have just won one million dollars. That's it? I guess I'll take it. I said a billion or a trillion, but a million's okay. And Anu is definitely not going to break through that. Should have saved the metal pipe. Would have been easier. Chapter 3 complete. Our lucky winner and... Franz Froger, bro. You can't panic the name that Franz Froger again. I'm sorry. What name would you pick? D did you actually pay money? You bought a blown out Froger shop. The same Froger shop we fled. And the only difference is it cost some plaque? Not the only difference. <laughs> this place is full of updates. You poor <laughs> now. <laughs> Fergus. Fergus. There's nothing for money because it's all for free. Oh, oh, oh my gosh, we bought a male stripper. Ooh! Oh yeah, he's looking juicy. Free labor. Free labor. Oh my gosh, Lou is twerking right now. What the hell is going on? You got the goods, kid. I mean, I also got another trophy for buying my first cosmetic item. Baby. Oh, oh, hell yes. Oh, girl. Let's just do foopity foopity foop real quick. I don't know why it needs to say poop foop. And then another gimme trophy just for completing chapter four. I do not care. That is the point, you incompetent buffoons. They are not worth my consideration. Just kill them. Dude, you got some idiots working for you, woman. You think you're gonna take over the world like this? I don't know why she decided to fight against this. She should've just taken all the power so she could've freaking murdered you know, Coldwell. The next trophy I crossed off the list was for experiencing the equivalent of a Thunder Down Under show 
if it were hosted in Pokemon Ruby. Uh, assist, what is that? <laughs> I just summoned a male stripper. Free labor. Free labor. Free labor. Uh, 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 is this like... Uh, bring back the butt? That was a trophy, hell yeah. Wait, that did damage? At the same time that I was catching a free show, I won a Pokemon battle against the 10th generation Pokemon that I can only describe as the offspring of a Sunny Day cast form and Gypsy Danger from Pacific Rim. And I'm sick of What's an unlimited break? And I'm sick of you. Is that an ultimate attack? My Super Mecha Bot! I called it! Mecha Bot versus Mecha Bot! Anger kicks ass, baby! I basically just was Super Saiyan for the first time, like Goku, whenever he watched Krillin die. On planet Namek. Hell yeah. Agreed. It worked for Goku and Vegeta. You get it. You finally understand it. Oh, my master plan is complete. To make you embrace all of your emotions. Not just. Oh, eat my butt, you broken ass. Oh, yeah, just keep the shit out of him. Beat him with that pipe wrench. Oh yeah, I forget that's what I chose in my little flashback. Uh, t 10 grand on the damage, holy shit. I knew there was gonna be a Mechabot versus Mechabot showdown. Those were the days. What's that even for? Win the retro battle. Fran got 4,000 EXP. Understand anger. I mean, it's totally a Pokemon ripoff. The next two trophies are technically missable, but still very easy to achieve. Firstly, we must win every Vault Lander's battle against this Maximus L Loser. You can find Maximus L Loser in the sewers, in Fran's fridge, in a morgue locker, in the trunk of a car, in the Great Hall of Tedior. And finally, in the office of Susan Coldwell. Right into my perfectly laid trap. No. Okay. You fell from an air duct. Did I? Yes. Then why was there the red X on the floor? Because of the trap. That's the rule. Hey, I know that weirdo. He's obsessed with vault landers. And we're playing. And if I win, you have to live in the air duct and breathe asbestos. Oh, well, I'm not totally not gonna win. Breathing asbestos? I love asbestos. Too bad I've got a sister to save. Takes reduced damage. All defense. I kind of want to use Morty or Br Brick. He's got the same attack as Morty and more defense. Like, it's a no-brainer. That's what I'm talking about, baby. You about to get Brick, son. You gonna get bricked the hell up. But, but not in the way you're thinking. Like he's he's gonna take some some brick, daddy. Now I, I, I don't think I've ever actually been hit in any of these. Like you could give this to a five-year-old right now and they would still probably win. Never played a video game before. Their hand-eye coordination is enough to win. I, I just I know they put this in here as like. A way to have collectibles that they can call back to the other Borderlands games and like let you know it's in the universe, but I just am not a fan of the mini game. I think I've said that every time I've played it. Like right here, I'm about to headbutt him into oblivion. Woo! Yeah, you can't mess with brick. That's Borderlands 3 brick right there. He's got the three dog paws. That's how you can tell it's Borderlands 3 brick. That's B team brick. And still champion win every Vault Lander's battle. In the same room as the final Vault Lander battle, we can also snatch a trophy for investigating all of our friends via illegal background checks courtesy 
of the Apple Watch 17.0. One second firearms journey through life. Hey, send it. Spiritual send it, bro. And how he became better for Might it. be a Promethea bestseller. And now he shot a lot of stuff along the way. That's a really long title. <laughs> Looking for constructive notes. Well, I mean, your Eat, Pray, Gun memoir still probably better written than The Rings of Power. Because that show literally destroyed all my hope in Amazon series. Series I? Series? Amazon video what or, it, it destroyed my hopes and dreams in prime video series as a whole Wait a minute it Says I can scan Brock I'm still a fan of the shooting you all in the head idea But I already scanned Brock they made the joke about him being naked Meridian Metroplex criminal inquiries 110,000 I forgot humans are slow Bounty assassin comedian represented by robot talent agency putting the ass in assassination He's doing stand-up sets out of super trusting friend for me back Got all the checks though Captain Finally after 10 hours of grueling torture We have beaten the game for the first time and if you stick around for what feels like an additional 30 minutes You can snag another trophy just for watching the credits I'm saying no one's looked at the bigger picture. It's headed into the Gladius Nebula. Time Great heals all wounds. Fiona. And she's gone. And she took my wallet? Alright, so you teased Fiona, that's it though? Hmm. So there's mirrors that shaped like a face. Two heroes. I know there's a trophy uh, for watching all the credits, but it is it is fun. I enjoyed making the content. I always enjoy making content, even if the game's not very good. I enjoy the process of making content. So don't think I'm just shitting all over this game and like it's a horrible, horrible, horrible experience. No. Now, if I wasn't making content, I might be a little more irritated, but I do, I, I was making content. After beating this miserable excuse of a Borderlands game for the first time, we can snag a few random trophies that take a bit of maneuvering to be accomplished easily. First, we need to beat a Vault Lander's battle with Claptrap. The easiest way to do this, after finding him in Chapter 1, is to go to the extra section of the main menu and fight Claptrap with Claptrap. Real quick. Claptrap. Claptrap. Claptrap versus Claptrap. Go ahead and win us a Vault Lander battle. Fight! Woohoo! Oh, yes. Sucker! That should be a trophy. I just had to win one with Claptrap. What? Why did... Why is that not a trophy? Okay, well... Um... Oh, okay, there it is. Murderous Mascot Mayhem. I guess I just had to hit X. Win a Vault Lander's battle using the Claptrap figure. Okay. Okay, that one wasn't glitched. Thank you. At least one of these suckers wasn't glitched. After successfully reenacting that one Spider-Man meme with everybody's favorite CL4P unit, we need to farm a large amount of money in a short amount of time. The easiest way to do that is to replay the section in Susan Coldwell's office over and over until we can easily obtain every cosmetic item. I mean, I don't know how to do this. What? Two or three times? If you count the last playthrough? It's 16,000. Here we go, right here. This should be the trophy. Okay! 
vain much obtain every cosmetic item in the game. We have no use for money anymore. After we get done picking all the fruit from our money tree outside, it is time to start over and continuously play the game over and over until we earn every Vault Lander. The problem is, there is not a single definitive guide on the internet that gives us the exact steps necessary to earn the four Vault Landers that are tied to certain endings. But in order to earn the Platinum for this game, I had to discover what those were. In doing so, I also received a trophy for achieving a skateboard score of at least 80% or higher. You have a business with all your homies. The healing ink is open for business. G-H-I, gee. Gee. Yeah, that kind of sucks. New business, baby! Thank you! Finish the game with a good skateboard rating. Oh, the hardest part of the game is over. Yes, baby! Oh, we still unlock zero. Oh, we had just enough. I don't know why we got that ending out of all those. But that trophy was for all the vault landers. So I did crack the code that apparently nobody on the internet is able to unravel and i'll explain them here in a second there are four vault landers that you get for beating the game okay uh and i got claptrap late but you find claptrap everything from claptrap and all of these up you get in the main campaign uh but lilith you get just for beating the game Okay, so as long as you beat the game, you will get Lilith. Yo. If you beat the game and one character dies, you will get Fiona. Or it's vice versa. I don't, I'm not 100% sure because I figured, or I, I got them at the same exact time. So one of these two, Lilith or Yo. Fiona, is for beating the game. And the other one is for beating the game and getting an ending where one of the characters dies. Now, Ellie, you get Ellie for beating the game with at least a 75% skateboard score and choosing to reject the shard. It does not matter what your relationship scores are. You just have to have at least 75% skateboard score and reject the shard. Zero. And zero, you get for having a 75% skateboard score and accepting the shard. So that is how you get all of the vault landers i have figured it out it has taken me months i've been on 20 different websites trying to figure it out as if guesstimating the steps to earn the final vault landers was not enough it was even harder to discern the steps to get all five endings i was able to get four out of five by myself easily enough but i was forced to find a guide on the interwebs to ensure fran died at the end of the game after 25 hours of pure torture, this finally happened. I'm sorry. He's done. I am too. This isn't the right dialogue. I'm sorry for shit. This dialogue right here means that I just wasted another four and a half hours going for this stupid fucking trophy. This is the worst fucking game ever made. Watch, I, I wasted my time. No, I did it! Holy shit, I did it! Well, you can tell Barney that he can go screw himself. Holy fucking fucker, fuck, I did it! Any progress? I hope heaven is one big orgy. The guide said to choose that. Hopefully that. Be one. Big orgy. I hope I don't get struck by lightning for choosing that. I I I, I did it for the trophy. I swear. I, I I I swear. Sweaty orgy. I d don't listen. I did not choose the rest of this dialogue. Okay. Okay. You know me. It was all your fault. Whoa. I'm gonna haunt your ass forever. Your ass is so. <laughs> oh, that's kind of funny. That's just tasteless. Okay, come on. But Fran would have loved it. 
She's right. Where's, I love it. where's the plat? Where's the plat? Oh, come on. Come on, give it to me. Yes! I finally did it! I finally did it! I never have to play this horrible game ever again! This is the happiest I've ever been getting a platinum trophy! I hate this game! With a burning passion! But I did it! I freaking did it! If you like this video and you want to see another one like it, click over there. If you want to see this entire playthrough from start to finish, click right here.